is good with y'all it's your boy ross back at again with another call of duty gameplay commentary i know it's been a minute since i've uploaded some gameplay footage i want to say it's been about two weeks it's probably been close to two weeks since i've actually played the game the last time i played the game we were still in season five we're in season six now um and uh, i've been hearing some mixed reviews about season six I I've only played like maybe one game so far and a lot of people have been saying like I guess some of the new guns like the new assault rifle is broken or something like you can shoot through walls like it's there's some bugs and glitches in this season that uh, a lot of people are not really too much feeling so it's like eh, you know it's more or less what you expect from Call of Duty they fix one thing and then they end up breaking another so but right now I'm playing this hard point like it's like hard point but like TDM or something like that where basically you hold the hard point and the more kills you get while holding the hard point I guess it adds to the score not sure something different so trying this out real quick I already played one game earlier you know what I'm saying trying to get this Call of Duty rust off because I haven't played in about a good two weeks so so my, my muscle memory is kind of a little shaky right now. But, you know, try to make some shit shake. And then I believe the beta is dropping this week for uh, Cold War. The Call of Duty uh, Cold War beta is dropping for PlayStation users this week. And I think Xbox users and PC users will be next week. I'm not sure. I really don't like that they do that. I mean, I get it for exclusive uh, like exclusive reasons and stuff like that but i i don't like that i i think i think it kind of messes up the whole purpose of a beta because you basically want to you know what I'm saying test out the servers and the ability for everybody to be able to play since it's going to be cross played enabled once again so it's like i feel like everybody should be on at the same time but hey when it comes to activision it's all about the bottom dollar that's what it's always been about so best believe when it does drop for playstation i will not playstation for xbox i will be uh um posting some gameplay footage of the beta so best believe uh you know be on the lookout for that and also for those who don't know i plan on getting uh the playstation 5 and the xbox series x i'm getting both of them because why not i want both of them and uh you know i don't want to be able to, i don't want to have to choose i want to be able to just play both consoles i have friends on playstation and xbox so i want to be able to play both consoles and just have a good time bro i don't want to have to choose which one i'm gonna play you feel me like i just want to be have both of them best of both worlds you know can't go wrong with that i'm not i don't i don't have no allegiance to one company if i'm gonna get both i'm gonna get both and call it a day so ah man so season six i mean i don't know maybe i'm getting burnt down on call of duty maybe call of duty i don't know i mean i, I love the franchise but you know it's um, there's stuff that like you want to take care of like it's not a, a hard like a high commodity for me anymore Like, it used to be, like, I gotta, I wanna play this, like, every day when I get a chance. And it's not so much, bro. It's just, like, honestly, whenever I get a chance to play it, when I get some free time, that's usually when I just hop on. And that's what it's kind of been like for the past couple of weeks. Um, I've actually been um, hanging out with somebody. Somebody pretty cool, you know, trying to get to know this individual, you know what I'm saying? So, I found myself hanging out with them more than playing a video game who thought you know what i'm saying it's, it's just one of those type of situations where it's like eh, call of duty will be there you know oh, season six all right cool i can check out some of the overpowered weapons later on like that's kind of how i look at this game now not to say if it was better i would i still wouldn't you know you know taking a break to spend valuable time with somebody but it's just one of those things I'd probably, you know, miss it a little bit more. These past two weeks, I have not missed this game. I'm not going to lie to you. I haven't been. 
I haven't been stressing over the BS that this game brings sometimes. Like, I've literally just been chilling. Like, that's all I've been doing. Just stress-free, man. Like, look at this. That dude was hungry for this kill. He was... He made it his mission to kill me. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 ain't, I ain't worried about that for the past two weeks. I've just been chilling with my uh my lady friend just having a good time man and when i say lady friend i actually do mean a friend that happens to be a lady like you know how people say oh that's my lady friend but really there's more to it than that you know what i'm saying no not in this situation like you know i'm, I'm at this point in my life where you know if i'm hanging out with somebody or spending time with somebody uh you know they gotta be worth it you feel me they got to be worth it, and I want to make sure that whoever I'm, I'm linking with, you know, we're able to vibe out and have a good time, and you know, I don't want anything to be rushed or any of anything of that nature. So, honestly, it's, it's just been me just getting a, getting a chance to, you know, just try to figure out who this person is, their ins and outs, and it's actually kind of a first situation for me. I know I'm... Over here getting into my, my you know, who I am and my relationships, my past relationships and stuff. But it's it's kind of different because this would be the first time I've actually decided to take things like, like truly slow and just, you know, enjoy the ride for what it is. You know, I think sometimes we, we kind of get lost up in trying to rush things and trying to get to the, the you know, to the nitty gritty of relationships instead of really getting a chance to figure out that individual and, and who is that person and what they're about. You know what I'm saying? So, it's, it's one of those things that's, you know, it's new for me. Not to say that any of my past relationships I've ever been in we rushed, but I could have took, you know, some more time to really get a feel for that individual and, and figure out if that person is someone, you know, you know, I want to really, you know, potentially be in a relationship with you feel me so right now i'm just having a good time with this person we're having fun and that just pissed me off because this dude is just sitting there oh that's annoying this is why i haven't played this game in weeks but nah i'm just having a good time with this person man and um i'm enjoying our company and and vice versa man it, it's all it's good to have that nowadays because some people have ulterior motives, you know what I'm saying? Some people's mindset change. Like, for those who don't know, you know what I'm saying? Like, YouTubers, not saying that I'm at that caliber yet, but YouTubers are pretty much like mini celebrities. So, sometimes when you tell somebody that you do YouTube and then you show them, like, your analytics and you show them, you know what I'm saying, you know that you're a decent sized youtuber like people's you know mindset and 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 how they approach and deal with you kind of change sometimes like some people they they really become opportunistic you know what i'm saying so they'll end up just basically being cool with you or trying to get to know you because they know you got a youtube so you could possibly help promote whatever that they're trying to promote you know what i'm saying and that's how people are, honestly. Like that's that's a real thing. So it's it's good to be able to hang with someone, and they not on that that type of vibe. Like this person that I've been you know kicking it with and having you know just hanging out with. She knows I do YouTube. You know what I'm saying? She subscribed to both my channels. She supports my channels, which I I truly appreciate. I didn't have to ask her to. And she doesn't look at me any kind of way. She doesn't treat me any kind of way. She doesn't come at me any kind of way. It's 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 as if I didn't have it. You know what I'm saying? It's just now that's one thing she knows about me, you know, that I'm you know, I'm passionate about. You feel me? And that I can respect. Cause once you tell somebody you got this going for yourself, you can usually tell real quick, you know what I'm saying, them their mannerism may change or how they talk to you or approach you may change but it's been consistent as hell she doesn't give a damn about that and i respect that and, and it's dope bro because sometimes i just want to you know 
I, I feel like I'm a normal person. And I tell her this all the time. And I tell people this all the time. I'm people are like, oh, you, you, oh, you, are, you a big time YouTuber. I'm like, nah, I'm not. I'm not. Even when we get to a million subs on the main channel, I still won't consider myself that because I'm just a regular ind individual that was fortunate enough to, you know, be able to do YouTube. You know what I'm saying? So um, it's just one of those type of situations. And we got our ass whooped. Who would have thought? Second game back after a few weeks of not playing. But it is what it is. But that's just what I've been up to for the past couple of weeks, man. Just enjoying this special someone's company and just, you know, having a good time. But it feels back. Feels good to be back playing the game a little bit. And it's, it's still kind of frustrating. Yeah, I'm not going to lie to you. If I had to choose between playing the game and hanging out with her a million times out of a million. I'm hanging out with her because this game can be uh, hella frustrating. But comment down below, man. If if any of you guys are, you know, you know, talking to someone like on a friend level, you know, and have have any of you guys ever been in that situation where, you know, you just you meet somebody and you're not even worried about being in a relationship with them. You just having a good time with them you just enjoying their company trying to build a friendship and get to know you know get to know about them comment down below if you guys have ever been in that situation or maybe you're in a relationship and how that's how that's going for you guys so but i appreciate all the love and support road to 30k appreciate y'all kicking in with me see y'all on the next one peace